In this video, we're going over three tips on how to improve your battery life on the Fitbit Versa and Fitbit Versa Lite. Hey everyone, thank you for joining us today. If you want to stay up to date on all the cool tech that's coming out and learn cool tips, tricks, and hidden features, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below and tap the bell next to it to turn on post notifications so you can be alerted every time we post new videos. I'm going to keep it short and sweet and show you three tips to help you improve your battery life on the Fitbit Versa. So let's jump right in. We're going to swipe left until you get to your settings wheel. Tap on that. And let's go ahead and adjust our, uh, there we go, make sure you guys can see it. So the first thing you'll wanna do is under the brightness, uh, you wanna change this, usually it's set to auto, but if you're really trying to stretch your battery life, I would say change it to dim. The dim setting will lower the screen, you'll still be able to see it, but the battery will last longer because the screen is not working so hard. The second thing you'll want to do is under display awake. You've got a couple of different settings here. This is when you turn your wrist. Um, it's basically when the screen comes on, how long it stays on before it goes to sleep. Let's go ahead and increase this just for the sake of the video. But So under display awake, you'll want to change this probably to either 10 seconds or 15 seconds. Put it down to a low number so that the screen doesn't sit on idle for too long. That will also help to stretch the battery for you. So those are two things there. And the next one is gonna be the heart rate option. Now, depending on how you use your Fitbit, you may want to not use, may not follow this tip. I use the heart rate when I work out a lot and I'm always tracking my heart rate because it matters in terms of what my goals are. If you don't care as much about the heart rate feature and you don't necessarily even pay attention to it, I would say turn this off. And now the Fitbit is not constantly checking your heart rate and that also will help to stretch the battery life as well. And to just show you one more little bonus tip here, and again, this is sort of based on how you use your Fitbit and what features are most important to you. If you hold down the power button, it takes you to this option here, and you have screen awake. So this is basically when you turn your wrist, when you flick your wrist, the screen automatically turns on. You can turn off that feature by putting it on manual and, and all that means is that the screen will only come on when you tap the screen versus when you turn your wrist. Now, think about it, we turn our wrist a lot throughout the day so the battery is, the screen is constantly turning on even though we're not using it. So by changing that to manual, it will stretch your battery life because now your screen is not constantly turning on inadvertently. And the last thing would be under notifications, you can just simply turn off notifications. Some people only use their Fitbit for the sake of tracking their workouts and checking the time and basic things like that and they don't link it to their phone. Therefore, having notifications sent to the phone are not necessary. So if you don't use that feature, if you don't have apps or text messages coming through and you'd rather you know, just have longer battery life, simply turn off notifications and that will also stretch your battery life as well. So obviously we said we'd give you three, we end up giving you five tips. And these are just little things that are gonna help you to improve your battery life on your Fitbit Versa and Fitbit Versa Lite. Leave us a comment down below. Let us know what tip was the most helpful for you. Try it out. We'd love to hear your feedback on the video. If there's other videos you'd like to see, leave it in the comment section down below and we'll definitely try to get to it. Thanks again for watching. Take care and have a good one.